me get the jeep. Take it easy, Kirby. I already got one. Jack. Wharton. Lenny. Hey. Jack. Darwin. Wharton again. Ah, Dad, I don't want to make you happy. Here you go, Kirby. Nelson. Uh, Holmes. To Roger, out. Rough him. Yeah, we'll patrol on the left flank. Heard some firing come from the outpost, but I tell him we got there, they'll get in clobbered. Better grab some rest. S2 reports a supply dump the other side of these hills. They want it knocked out. What about air? Haven't been able to spot it. Got a couple of replacements for you. Another green? I didn't ask. Just looked at him again. That grenade really tore him apart. <laughs> Take it easy, man. Take it easy. Sarge, I picked up one for you. Oh, you better tell you to get some rest. We're moving out again. And uh, pick up some thermite grenades. All right. Hey, is that from home? Yeah, it's my kid brother. Chip, I know it's been a long time between letters, but while well, with this part-time job in school, well, I've been pretty busy. <laughs> hey, get me. You guys are fighting a war over there, and I'm telling you how tough civilian life is. Mom's fine, sends her love. She really misses you. Well, I don't want to sound too corny, but so do I. Hey, you remember Charlie Thompson? He was a year ahead of me in school. He got himself a medal over in the Pacific somewhere. <laughs> you know, you guys used to kick him out of the clubhouse all the time because he was so young. Yeah, there's, a, there's a lot of guys in now. Look, I, I guess I've stalled long enough, Chip. Uh, I'm going to tell you something, and, and please don't get mad. I'm not going to finish school. I've enlisted. Look, Mom signed the papers, but, but don't blame her. She didn't want to, but I talked her into it. Oh, that dumb kid. The bad news? Hey, morphine. Give me some morphine. I know what you must be thinking right now, Chip, but I just wanted to do it, so please try and understand. Hey, it's, it's been a long time since you've seen me, huh? You can't tell by the picture, but I'm almost as tall as you are. I'll bet I'll look pretty snappy in my uniform, huh? Look, as soon as I find out where I'm stationed, I'll write you and give you my new address. And, Chip, don't worry, huh? I'll be okay. You take care of yourself. And don't go finishing that war until us younger guys get over there. Hi, Kirby. My name is uh, Johnson. Uh, this here is Jim Hummel. Hey, what do you say? 
He was afraid you guys were going to end the war before we got here. <laughs> yeah, no chance of that. And Vic Morrow. Saunders? Yeah. I'm Johnson. That's Hummel. Private Jim Hummel, Sergeant. Well, you might as well uh, relax. We'll be here for a little while. Sergeant, will we be going up to the front soon? You're on the front, Hummel. Texas in August. <laughs> Is that where you're from? No. I just trained there. Camp Walcott. Oh. You don't want a cup of bad coffee, do you? Never drank the stuff. Yeah, maybe I ought not to criticize it. Someday I might be old and weak myself. Hey, uh, you don't happen to have a can of that good foot powder, do you? No. Why? You find out soon enough. <laughs> I got my boots pretty well broken in. All right, all ready to go, are you? Oh, oh. Doctor. Never saw a dead man before. Guess you get used to it. Was he a buddy of yours? Oh, I knew him. You never get used to it, Hummel. King two, Roger out. Saunders. I got a new report from S2. Their info puts the supply dump just about in here. They're not sure where. Looks like good cover all the way. Uh, Lieutenant, uh, new replacement, Hummel. What about him? Well, we might be better off if we didn't take him out on this one. What do you mean? Well, he's green. Things will to get hot out there. Saunders, you've been out with green men before. Besides, you're shorthanded. Better get going. All right. Doc. Okay, let's.
Let's go. Keep going. And check that road near the side of the lake.